Hey guys, welcome back to the Gamer Play. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Chrono Trigger for the Sony PlayStation, and this game is brought to you by GamingOne.com. So, wow, like, man, I was telling you, these guys just freaking jumping all over. Oh, Jesus, you just know there's more. Where did that guy even go? I don't know what these guys are doing. Look at this guy. <laughs> okay, buddy, you can stop it now. I've passed you. Crazy motherfuckers. Oh, Jesus. So I guess, you know, I was saying earlier, I like when you can see the enemies before you have to attack them. Because then it's easier to avoid them. Well, I guess in some cases, it's kind of fun to be surprised by them jumping out and doing crazy weird shit and gimmicks. We're going to go to the pass soon, and there's another example there. Another gold helmet. Let's put that on Marley. She can use that, can't she? Oh, no, she can't. Okay, Robo. A robot with a golden helmet. Sure, why not? Looks like that guy woke up. This guy. We can't avoid him either. But we can always run. Probably a better idea anyway. I hate those guys. It's very shady today, isn't it? Oh no, this is bad. Oh! Right in his noggin, man. I don't like the Ogans. It's a waste of a nice uh, treasure chest there. What the hell do I need to find mid tonics for? Come on. A rainbow there. Look at that water move. Whoa! Hey! Hey! What the hell was that? So if that shit hits you, it reduces your HP by a little bit, which is kind of a uh, clever. And then you know, Chrono yelps there. Keep climbing! You son of a bitch! Oh Jesus! What's up with these freelancer guys anyway, huh? I always talk about what monsters do off the clock, you know, when they're not on duty, ready to ambush people. You know, what do they just stand here all day waiting to ambush people? So what do they do afterwards? You know, go to the pub, have a drink. And where do these guys get their clothing? Hmm. These are the questions I ask. More cash. Looks like we're at the peak here. Look at that view. Marley, push him. Push him. More cash. Okay, here's another interesting example. Hey, how you guys doing? See, this is what I was talking about. I guess they're off the clock right now. What are they doing? They're, uh, they're... Shining their weapon there. They're polishing their blade. How you guys doing? Shut up. Get lost. Shut up. Get lost. Hey, man, come on. I just want to be friends, man. I just want to be friends. Another uh, kind of funny note. Oh, we'll get to that. So then the bird comes and says, Hey, guys, come on. You need to get on the clock. There's people here. We got to ambush them. You're being lazy. I'm a, I'm a bellbird. Look at me. I'm a bellbird. I'm a bird who carries a bell. Of course! Of course! I don't know what the hell's going on. So then the bird rings the bell, and that's, like, supposed to hurt me. Fuck you, bellbird. 
Also, I like the RPG games when you're fighting the monsters and you defeat one kind of the enemy, the, the name will disappear on the left side of the screen. As you can see, you know, the names are still listed there. I actually prefer when the, uh, the names disappear. Uh, I like that style better. Anyway, I was gonna I was gonna mention that uh, you can let go of the uh, of the controller, and you start to Jesus, and you start to you know slip down the uh, the stream. The current is taking you, and there's a fucking waterfall here, and you do not want to let the current sweep you down that waterfall. Oh Jesus, it can happen right there too. Freaking out! I do not want to fall down there. If you do, it takes you back like to the beginning. That is a big no-no, but hey, it's kind of interesting. So once again, what is this guy doing? Shut up! Get lost! Cranky, man. These guys, these freelancers are cranky. Okay, I'll, you know, have a good day, buddy. Up! Oh, Up! Oh, oh, now he's, now he's gonna want to fight. Crazy! It's crazy! Freelancers are kind of pussies, though. It's like two hits max, one or two. Buka! You die! Two of them gives you four tech points. That's not bad, either. Okay. A little bridge there. Who made that? Hey, look! It's Specchio! Is it the same guy? Ooh, what is this? Mountain's nice. This is the life. Mountain's are nice. Man, you're nosy. Here, take this. Magic tab. Thank you. I'm going to use that right now. So, yeah, talk to that guy a couple times. Gives you a magic tab. Thanks a lot, buddy. Yep, yep. Give that the chrono. The women in video games always have the best magic attacks, right? Their magic ability, right? That's how it's supposed to be. Women can do magic better. The men can do physical attacks better. Save spot. Oh, I know what that means. Wait a minute. What, what's down there? What, what's all this? Hmm. I forget what's over there. Oh, wait. I thought this was a cave. I thought that was the cave right there. Okay, Dave's getting confused, but let's get that tab. I almost forgot about that. Ugh. Dave's getting confused. We're supposed to go this way. Oh, another one of those assholes. Gold suit hidden right there. We don't have any of them, do we? Oh, no, we do. Uh, Oh, yeah. We, we bought them. It's totally useless. If we're gonna buy them, why do they put it there? There's a spot a little later. Oh, yeah. They put the save spot there because... Kind of like the point of no return. Stop hitting me, asshole! Jesus. Jesus! <laughs> I woke him up. Looks like you guys aren't uh, as heavy sleepers as that other dude I was uh, trying to wake up earlier. How you doing, guys? Go on, oh, they're going back to sleep though. Anyway, before I was talking about, there's uh, there's an area in the game coming up where uh, you're not supposed to venture to. You're not supposed to go there, but you can, and you can actually pick up uh, a decent uh, piece of equipment uh, before you head over to uh, another area of the game. I don't know. It's just. It's one of those where you can, you know, just basically pick up uh, armor that's better than your current armor, but you're not supposed to go there. Can I explain that? What a dick. Look at this guy. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, this is a big one right here. Ah, it's a fight he wants. I'm fighting these guys, man. Freelancers. Look at that. He's got like a little helmet on. See that helmet? 
kind of looks like his head. It's shaped like his head, obviously. He's got, like, this helmet on. I guess if Kane from Final Fantasy IV was a bird, he would look like this. Wrong guy. Robo, we need to upgrade you. But since that safe spot is there, I'd say there's something coming up that's going to be crazy. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. I'm Dave the Usher for The Gamer Play. Stay tuned for the next part of Chrono Trigger. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.